Helen and the crew is great because it, you know, it was me and John Watts when we're on the set of, of Spider-Man. I was just sort of sniffing out if it's something he, he might be into doing. He's like, I have a whole idea for what I would do. And I, we were just talking on the set and I called Dave yeah. from, I was out in Atlanta. I was like, Dave, this sounds really good. You, you want to listen to this idea? That's not good. We hopped on a Zoom call. They pitched through what it was, just the very basic strokes. I was like, this is great. It focused on young people. It's always good to have new characters coming in. And there are so many different tones now in Star Wars. You know, you have Andor that, you know, uh, is, is intrigue and a thriller, you know? You have adventure, you have uh, with, with the Mandalorian. Get, uh, you know, samurai adventure with Ahsoka. So to have this young Amblin feeling movie with young people seeing it for the first time, seeing who grew up in the Star Wars world and are exposed to adventure, the puppets, the costumes, the the visuals, the world that's being expanded upon. And now I get to write the next season of Mandalorian with all these new characters and new locations and new creatures. So it just keeps adding, adding more and more. And so we're, there's this cohesive group of stories that are being told uh, thanks to all these filmmakers that are contributing.